Back. Welcome back to Predictions. Now, Clara lost her son when he was only 13 of an asthma-related heart condition. She would like to know whether or not he's still suffering and, of course, if he visits her. And she's there with Derek Cora now. So, over to you. Hello, Clara. Hello. It's lovely to speak to you. Mm -hmm. And as I've been sitting here with you, um, the emanations of three lovely souls are around you. Virtually to the back, to the right-hand side, I do see uh, a young man for definite, to the back and to the left-hand side, two ladies. Now, I know they brought this lovely young man into the atmosphere. I know because he's looking at you with eyes of tenderness and goodness. And he also, I know he's been over in this world of spirit for quite a number of years. However, he comes and he shows himself as he was, which he can do that as a young person. I can assure you because he's... The, this lady here is saying, oh, when he first come over, when our Roger first come over, it, it, his chest and his, it, that asthma and anything to do with his chest is all clear. It, her words as bright as a pin. And he's smiling, like in agreement, looking at her. So she must have been one of the first to receive Roger, your lovely son, OK? Yeah. And can I just say this to you, please? Also, this lovely lady, please, uh, before she came over to the World of Spirit, um, she, because I feel it, it does link here, I feel her walking uh, capacity and what have you, please, if not the walking, the upper side here wasn't uh, in what we call the greatest of health but um she's fine lovely and her uh, hair coloring as i'm closing my eyes i've got to do that for some reason because she pushes back and then comes back but her hair coloring is exactly the same as yours yeah. and she loves you okay and she loves roger now the other lady please i know what she came over with but, um two spirits i feel she came over not in an old age i feel she would she would have barely reached 60 barely and i feel um that i'm getting um thank you yes 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 i will it sounded like to me the younger lady mary mary or something that sounds like mary oh, hold on just a moment the younger person please the lady here please with the white hair please she is so super close to you okay that she's like your double yes now the other one here please i keep on getting um those conditions coming through here um Yes, thank you. Was there a connection with Alice and Mary in some manner? I don't know, Mary. You don't know? Yeah. Okay, well, she's coming in there, okay. But I feel his grandmother, Roger's grandmother, you know, yeah. said, come on, son, I'm here. Do you understand me? Or the links afterwards coming in. Um, or she's come from those vibrations. I'm guessing one coming in. Now, Roger's just said these words about his dad about his dad. Oh, something about, Mum, keep on taking the pills. <laughs> yeah. OK? Keep on taking the pills, because they do you good, Mum. He's noticed, OK? Yeah. And the visitation. Can I just say this to you, please? I don't know. He's noticed his dad, even in his later years, he's no, apart from yourself, he's noticed dad going into the kitchen area and making a cup of tea, making a brew, OK? He does that for you, doesn't he? Does, he? Yeah. yeah. And he said, good on you, Dad. Good on you looking after Mum like that. He, he loves his dad as well, OK? Yeah. Um, can I also... Who's John? My nephew. Yes, he's talking about him. He said, tell Mum and tell John... Uh, well, tell Mum and tell Dad that he can see something happening next week around John. You'll hear the news about John. And it'll please his family. Uh, but it'll surprise me, Dad, and you. But he, he's not going to tell me what it is. Please. OK? But he said he's visited many times. And he's tried to... He's actually touched you. Have you never felt touch? Uh, yes. yes. Yes? And also, which one of you, either Dad... One of you spotted something by curtains, haven't you? Who's been... Have you seen anything by curtains? No, my granddaughter did. Ah, your granddaughter. Because he's noticed someone had noticed him by curtains. OK? Mm -hmm. And that's real, Mum. He's saying, I was there. OK? Yes? He's a fine man now, but as he shows himself there to you, and he wants to give proof on this programme today that he promises you, and I'm making a promise on his behalf, that he's going to come into your home with Dad, OK, whilst you're there, OK, and he's going to do something. Um, he said, I've learned how to do this now. So whatever he's going to produce, Clara, and for Dad, OK, I promise you, you'll never forget it. It'll be beautiful. It'll be serene. 
It'll be gorgeous. And also, your mother's going to bring you flowers, so you'll smell the scent of flowers all around the house, OK? Yeah. Um, he's saying something about, who's been talking about slipping on a carpet? Me, I've slipped. You slipped on the carpet? Mm -hmm. He said, I didn't like that, Mum. And he was around, picking you up, OK? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yes. Always, yes. And he's asked the healers from the world of spirit to help you, OK? Mm -hmm. Thank you. But he said, keep taking the, t the tablets, because the doctors are doing well with those tablets, OK? Right, yeah. All right? Thank you. Yeah. Thank yes. you very much indeed for that. OK, thank and thank you, Clara, as well. Extraordinary stuff from Derek, as always.